in this simulation, in this PHET simulation, you will be building molecules. Remember, the molecules are built out of the non-metal atoms. So, as you are building these molecules, you look here to the to the right. All of these elements that you will be using, they are non-metals. Um, there's no metal in here. So, all of these molecules or all of these compounds are held together by what kind of bonds? The covalent bonds. The covalent bonds hold together non-metals in molecules. Um, <clears throat> so here's what you're working with. Here are sort of your ingredients, and you can go through the different kits of the ingredients by clicking on kit one. I guess it, uh, it lets you go to the next kit after you've used these um, elements. So for example, I can build a molecule of hydrogen by bringing these two, two hydrogen atoms together and see it tells you where to take it so you will drag it to there and there you have a molecule of hydrogen if I wanted to build let's say a molecule of water I would need two hydrogen and an oxygen but I don't have any more hydrogens here so I just need to refill my kit and I drag my hydrogens and here is molecule of water and so you would you would drag it over there uh, to build carbon dioxide I would need carbon but I don't have any carbon here so that's where you can go to the next kit um, and here I have carbon so now I can be build carbon dioxide and so forth uh, you need to fill this whole collection one um, and in this activity you also need to collect the 3d or take screenshots of the 3D models of these different molecules. So that's where you click on the 3D and a 3D model is uh, uploaded. Now I would like you to see the individual bonds between the atoms in these molecules. And so down here click on the ball and stick. Again here you can see there's a space filling like this model and then there is a ball and stick model. And in this one you can see the actual um, covalent bonds between the individual atoms. So you can see that between the the oxygen and the carbons, um, they're sharing two pairs of electrons. Each pair of electron represented by one of these sticks in here. So that we call this a double, a double covalent bond. So please take a screenshot of these images. Uh, they're rotating, so take a screenshot when you can actually see the the double bonds. Like right now, I would take a screenshot. Okay and save all of the uh, all of these pictures of all of the molecules from this collection one and then once you take um, a screenshot of this screen with all of these molecules filled um, let me do that quickly here for you so carbon dioxide here I just need three more molecules uh, let's refill this so I can here's a molecule of oxygen and I need a molecule of hydrogen here's my molecule of hydrogen yep you're complete you're completed you completed your collection and so I would take a screenshot of this screen right now showing that I have completed collection one so I would press print screen and I would open something like paint maybe here is my picture save as and I would call it collection one complete and I will save it and then you can upload that picture um, the next thing or the last thing you will do after the after you uh, have done this and then again take a picture of each of these 3d models ball and stick models so here is the single covalent bond between two molecules between two atoms of hydrogen in a molecule of hydrogen so after you've taken pictures of all of those 3D models, then you go to complete multiple. And here uh, you will be creating these molecules, but it tells you in here that you're supposed to do more than just one. So for example, here you're supposed to collect two molecules of carbon dioxide, or, and here two molecules of oxygen. So to complete this, I would need two molecules of oxygen yep. and once this is completed you take a screenshot again showing that this section is complete the collect multiple uh, 
and you only need to do collection one. Now, after, if you'd like to, you can then go to collection two uh, and further to build more molecules. You can also build these larger molecules in here. But don't forget to take a screenshot when this first collection of the multiple uh, molecules is completed and then save that picture and upload it into the Moodle link to demonstrate that you have completed this, uh, this activity here.